Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. We are headed down to the barn to see our girls. I'm in love with our girls. It's so, been so Good fun girl. being home and cleaning the yard and... She knows, she knows to sit and wait. What are you forgetting? What Good are you girl. forgetting? Look at how well behaved she is compared to these hooligans. I don't know if you guys can see these. These are my favorite breeches. They look awful. The camera always makes everything look dirty and yuck. They look like they're... Anyway, these are my favorite breeches. They're super worn. I have about six pairs of them. They're from Greenhawk. And the thing that I like about them is that they kind of fit like leggings, but they're not leggings. They're super thick, so they hold you in. They squish all of your body together, which you know when you reach a certain age that that sometimes can be a benefit. So they are, they are like a fitted breech. I think, but they stretch. They're like made of elastic. I don't know. Whoops. I like my breeches better. I don't know if I can get Those a good. Those were mine. Yeah, these were all Sophie's and Gabby's, and I stole them. No, they're all mine. Because you can wear a, you can wear like any size in them because they stretch that that much. Anyway, I love these breeches. Yeah, they're the most comfortable feeling. They hug your whole body, hold you tight, but they expand so you don't feel uncomfortable, and they're not like spandex where it's like that weird funky material this this is cotton in them and I like cotton but yeah they oh they're just so nice I got them at Greenhawk they're like elation elation maybe oh I'm gonna buy myself some I've never bought a pair of them I have all the girls old ones Daisy ran into that field to try and catch a bird yeah Daisy the bird catcher come on she sees them in the air and once they go too high she can't see them anymore hello girls this is our last day to this week and then dad will be back. Here we go, buttercup. There we go. There we go. We might ride today, Penn. I'm all dressed for it. If the rain stays away, then this girl and I are gonna ride like the wind. We're gonna ride like the wind, right, Penny Pickle? Hopefully, hopefully she has energy like she did yesterday. You guys saw in yesterday's video, she had energy again. And Sylvia and I came down here after supper and spent like a couple hours down here. It was so fun. I didn't bring the camera. I took Penny out in the back and I let her run. I sat on the grass while she ate. She didn't run. <laughs> but I sat on the grass while she ate and she looks. And that's the thing. When you're bonding with your horse, they always be looking at you. They always be trying to figure you out. And uh, even when you don't think they're looking, they're looking. And I was sitting on the grass and she was watching me. And she was enjoying herself. And... She was enjoying herself, but she was looking at me and she was associating me with all this amazing grass she was eating. And then Sophie was jumping Willow out there. Sophie was working Willow in here. Mama. I know. Good girl. What a good dog. Sort of. <laughs> What a good worker. It's 15 degrees Celsius today, it's supposed to be, but but rain, and I can tell that the rain is coming. Hopefully it stays away long enough for me to get a ride in. She already knows. Okay, do it, okay, now do it. Just, she gets too distracted when you go too far. No chance to look at me more. <laughs> Always a work in progress, you guys. I have a theory that deaf dogs take a little bit longer to get perfected in their training because it's more difficult. But she's, she's, she's like, yeah, like she's doing great. You're doing great. And the, there's so many distractions down here. Walking on a leash. There's there's so many distractions. And you guys know that she wants to eat the poop and she wants to play with the other dogs and she wants to run and so she's doing great. Right? Girl, Ruby. Molly says, like, don't show me up. Oh, I know. Ruby's like Finn. Jumping is in her blood. She just loves to jump.
good girl. And look how good she's walking on the leash. Sophie worked on that with her the other day, like so much. She's probably our best dog on a leash. There, there you go, yeah. We're gonna ride today, so go out there and get yourself some energy. Sylvia has a knack I for- I it yesterday, so I got it today. Yeah, Sylvia has such a knack for TikToks and stuff. I don't even know how she does it. How do you get them to go together like that without editing? You just, I'm I've never- take a random video. Oh, I've never done that before. Like all your life, God is telling you and giving you clues on what you're meant for. All your life, your entire life. And I'm trying to post one once a day. it's things like this where where I like when I'm trying to make videos I have to like plan and figure and it never goes right and Sophie literally can just stand in one spot Whip out her phone at the last minute and get the best video like she I don't even know where she was and she got this incredible beautiful TikTok. like it just was, was really like good seconds, I couldn't change it to a minute. Oh well still like it, it was so good. So yeah, so if you're wondering if you're there stuck going along every single day wondering what the heck am I supposed to be doing with my life because I've been there then you just need to stop and wait and watch for signs God is giving them to you all the time I watch you as you drive smile do you know how much i love you you put my favorite song on i put my feet up and we just sing along and i can't help but feeling just loving this moment can we stay here forever i'm loving this moment can we stay here together if i could stop the time don't you know that I would Cause I'm just loving this moment Can we stay here forever 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 I watch you as you sleep You don't know I'm looking so the plan for today is, I can see the rain coming. We're gonna go up to the house, get a drink, let the ponies eat a little, and then we're gonna come out and ride. Because I have a feeling this day is not gonna be a good riding day. She's gonna be going to the barn tonight and riding Storm because she hasn't been able to ride him that much this week. She's been working on Chino. Chino's getting ready for Trillium, but you guys should know I get a lot of comments about you guys never do flat work You guys should know that our lessons and our rides are divided half three quarters flat and then a quarter Jumping, jumping. like we I'm do flat work that. every single and ride Brandon does a little more jumping than fly and Fiona does a little more flat Fiona work. does Fiona does so much fly you would not even believe like Sophie hates it, but that's what's right and that's what's better and then Brandon does less flat. Oh, get me a water. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna get a water too. Also, someone was concerned that I never appreciate Brandon. I love our Brandon. I love everything about him. What I was meaning yesterday is that Brandon never went anywhere. He's been with us all along. I'm getting water. We all like the water down here. The barn water is the best water. Um, but yeah, like Brandon never left us. He's always been here and I appreciate that so much. But now that Fiona's back, we have like more stuff going on. Fiona fixes some things that we do wrong and Brandon fixes some things that we do wrong. They're both different. They both bring us equally amount of amazing. All trainers relate to people differently. Like there was a time when Gabby didn't understand anything that Brandon said. Now she relates to him so well. Brought you a water. I just okay. 
Good job. Do you approve? You looking for ice? Our water oh, in the bar? In it. <laughs> yeah. That's why we love it so much. I just wanted to show you guys. These are what the breeches look like. So they look like this. They're, they're called elation. These are a size 30. You know what I hate about them? What do you hate? I hate that I wore them to death. Like they're... They have the this part. This yeah, part. so they have this tight. I love that. That's like my favorite. So I can't explain what kind of material they are. It's kind of like a cotton... And it should say, but I can't read it because it's so worn. But anyways, I love them. You can just put them on and they stretch as high as you want them to stretch or they stay as low as you want. Yeah, I love them. I ripped them like I sewed them so many times. I have about five pairs, but I love them all. These ones are going to the garbage. Practically the only kind I like to wear. Anyway, we came back to the house, did a few chores, and now we're going to go down. I'm going to ride because I see uh, the rain is coming. I've seen those faces, I've heard all the lies, but you ain't gazing on someone in denial, cause you want dollar bills right now, but you gotta I swept the floor under Penny and it might not seem like a big deal but Penny is terrified of brooms and when in the past whenever I've tried to sweep in front of her like by her feet she has lost her mind and today she did not lose her mind at all she let me sweep the whole area back and front she's a little more nervous about the back but that's because I haven't really worked on the back with her Ew, what did I wipe on me <laughs> yuck anyways so impressive I taught her that. That's not breaking, Pretty just excitement. Strong. Okay, Gabby and Sophie are trying to saddle up her. And I am gonna try the new saddle. I don't even know if my girth works for this, to be honest. I don't even know how to hook up the girth. We should give ourselves more time. All right, come on, we're ready. I'm ready, the rain hasn't started and we're ready to ride. She fell off the bicycle jump. Oh my gosh, so Sophie's baby. Sophie's practicing her coaching skills, you guys. The baby fell off twice. I feel like on her first ride. Oh my gosh, look at how that baby is. Oh my God. Oh, her baby died. All right, I'm just about to get on. This is the saddle and Fiona is loving how it fits. I sent her lots of video, lots of clearance. Anyways, I'm gonna get to ride in my Kunkel gloves for the very first time ever. And I'm gonna set this, the camera up and hopefully get some footage. Something knocked you out You felt your limitations And filled your mind with doubt You wanna stay chill right now And don't let your eyes off the prize I know you want it to be easy So let your guard down And I said See it
everything still have so much to learn I sent video to Fiona and Fiona was like you have to stop pulling back so much and it's true I, I don't let her go fast and when you're holding it doesn't seem like you're pulling back but then when you're watching it looks like you're pulling back so I get what Sophia is going through but anyway it was I love that saddle I felt like it was the first time I've ever ridden in a saddle that put me in the exact right place uh, Fiona looked at, I sent her a gazillion pictures. She already tried the saddle on the horse, so knows that it fits the horse, but, um, and it fits me. That's the big difference. Quiet walk, and it was the very first ride with that saddle that I ever felt like we could go on a trail ride. Not a Gabby and Kaylee trail route trail ride, but just like a nice quiet trail ride. Like it was fun. It was a fun ride for me. Sophie wants to show you guys. Yeah, you're probably traumatizing her. Are we gonna do the somersault one or the just okay? So Sophie's gonna show you all. Sophie's been doing a lot of work on her on her training on her training. She's training this baby to ride, and she wants to show you guys how they've progressed. Sophie's baby kept dying. She, they have really good video. So we're gonna see how Gracie does. Gracie refused. Gracie's like, I will save you, baby. She never wants her baby to die. Up. <laughs> no matter what side I go on, the baby falls on the other side. Poor baby. Whoever thought that when I bought Sophie all those babies that that's, this is what it would come to you guys. She would use them as guinea pigs in her in her jumping school. What the heck is that? A bird. How did you get a bird? It was in the head. All right, bye. It was in our house. Yeah, yeah I was in your room. <laughs> it was in my room. He's cute. Why is it inside? It looks so young. Why was it inside? How did it get inside? The bird's nest is right outside. Excuse me, dude. You are like hurting me. Okay, if a bird can get in our house, <laughs> that's alarming. Let me take a picture. We're gonna go let him free. He's so cute. Because you do not belong in our house. There better not be bird poop on my bed, dude. <laughs> That stays in my room. How is that possible? <laughs> she probably brought, brought it. She inside. probably was like, oh, 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 we just, it just started raining. All right. Yeah, he's gorgeous. Okay. Sorry, bird. Whoa, there you go. Wow. Before, the girls came back to the house before me. I was uh, oiling my boots and luckily I checked on the demon in the house. How, what, do you guys heard a demon? We heard it fly We heard something. something. I'm like, I'm coming. <laughs> <I'm coming. laughs> Sophie and I be running out of the house. Gabby runs to the demon. Oh, no, I didn't. I was just going to go find She followed me up. So the weird thing is, is that throughout my entire life, I've come home from places and found birds in my house. It's not weird. Like, no matter what house we live in, I found birds flying in my house. So I believe it's a sign. I don't know what it means, but I believe it. Alright, we're headed to the grocery store because... I think you forgot something on the yeah. chair. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> uh, we're headed to the grocery store because it's the only place we can go to get food. Uh, the only place we can go are to exercise our horses and to get food. So we're going to go and get food for the weekend. So, uh, I don't know what it's like in the States. Well, I know it's not the same. Normally we have spring break in March, but because of COVID, they change the spring break so you guys probably don't know but we just entered spring break so we can't go anywhere we can't do anything we can't see any people but there's no school so i'm hoping that's gonna take us oh they just got oh, on the button screen. wow look at that little willow she's just whoa did you guys see her when we looked down there, she was fucking up a storm. And then Penny came flying, tell her to behave, but actually you guys can see, Penny is not the leader of that herd. That is the leader. Penny is not the leader of that herd.
Don't you know that you're beautiful?